Developing tonight, IMPD is investigating after three soldiers from the Netherlands were shot outside of a hotel in downtown Indianapolis. Two of them are in critical condition, and we've also learned that the White House and State Department are now involved. CBS 4's Max Lewis has the latest on the investigation and explains why the soldiers were here. Just after 3.30 Saturday morning, IMPD officers were called to the Hampton Inn Hotel in Indianapolis's Entertainment District. They found three people shot, two of them critically wounded. All were taken to area hospitals. It was not something that occurred inside the hotel. It was a previous altercation, we believe, at another location. We're still working through that with all of our witnesses. The Dutch Ministry of Defense announced that the three shooting victims were members of a special forces unit. According to the Indiana National Guard, the soldiers were training at the Muscatatuck Training Center in the southern part of the state. They were visiting Indianapolis on their day off. We're working with the State Department and the White House to resolve this issue. IMPD detectives were spotted back at the scene today, canvassing nearby businesses for surveillance cameras. One business owner said cops were hoping to catch a car driving by at the time of the shooting. You can see a couple of windows here on the hotel door have been busted out. While it's not clear if it's connected to the shooting, a hotel guest and an employee said it wasn't like that yesterday. Two hotel employees also told me the soldiers were staying at the hotel and the rest of the group checked out today. A man dressed in a Dutch military uniform was seen sitting in a police car outside the hotel this afternoon. It's kind of scary. I mean, you really wonder if you're going to make it home or not. Downtown was crawling with people today, many unaware of what had taken place. The shooting, which happened just a block away from Monument Circle, has some questioning how safe they are in the heart of downtown. It's like you can't even go out and have dinner with friends without worried about if you're risking your life. Police said they have no suspect description and are encouraging anyone who knows anything to give them a call. In downtown Indianapolis, Max Lewis, CBS 4 News. Max, thank you. Now, we have reached out to numerous agencies, including the Dutch military, the White House, and the State Department. So far, we have not heard back from any of them. And IMPD also had no updates on the soldiers' conditions when we asked.